What up, big time gang? Welcome back to another Tommy Big Time video. This one here is another Nubio. This one's got like an ocean type motif on the box. Just a cardboard sleeve. We're going to get right into it after the intro. So, let's open this bad boy up. Nubio. This is uh, the second watch from Nubio I've uh, done an unboxing on. And uh, super excited to show you guys just what I've got. So, inside of the box, you got Nubio branding on what feels like just cardboard. Cardboard box. Got the Ventana is a brand as the uh, the make of this watch. The Ventana remote operating underwater vehicle ROV, perhaps one of the most prolific and enduring submersibles in operation, with a record of over 4,100 dives. ROV Ventana is by far the most experienced and enduring scientific ROV in the world. This is limited edition number 408 of 500. Very nice looking oceanic scene. So that's a little card that it comes with. You got foam. And then we have got the watch. Watch is wrapped in plastic. And boom. Now I can tell you right off the bat, I like this a lot. This was one of the ones when I looked on their site when Nubio first hit me up that I was like, I wouldn't mind having that one. It's got the crown at the four, which you guys know I love. Um, it's big, it's beefy, but it's different. Very, very different. I just did a, a, a video, you guys will see here, you know, in a month or so, on a deep blue that has a wave dial. This has a very similar dial, but this is more... Um, unique. It's got hills and valleys and um, more dimension to the dial itself. Let's get this cover off. Very good looking dial. And then a black IP case. Heal and release valve there at the 9 o'clock. Very simple branding. Just a Nubio. And then you got the 1000 meter water resistance. Your directional bezel feels great. This kind of has a look of like a a giant um, baby tuna, something similar to that. I like the look of this watch a lot. Nice silicone strap. Let's get this off the buckle. So obviously this is a Ventana, is what this is called. Um, I'll show you the model number here. NB604607. That is the model number. This is the Ops Black version. Obviously for uh, the fact that it's, you know, a combat looking watch all blacked out. Let's wind it up. This does have a SII Japanese NH35 movement in it. <clears throat> Automatic 24 joules. Let's set the time. Those hands are humongous. Okay, I know the time is after 12. 12. 50 almost 1 p.m. oops what am I doing okay 1250 and then we'll do the date I know my NH 35s I know that the date on the NH 35 is always turned clockwise and we want to get to the 29th 
very small date window at the four o'clock. I think they should have done without it, honestly. Even if they use the NH thirty five and they set that as a ghost um, function, um, there's no need for a date. It would have been so much cleaner without it. But there is a date there at the four o'clock, um, or maybe put it at the three. I don't know. I just don't. I feel like that doesn't belong there. It would just look so much better without it. Uh, this is a sapphire crystal with anti-reflective coating. Like I said, unidirectional bezel, screw down crown. Very beefy hands. I mean, look at the hands on this watch. Very different, very beefy. Um, you're going to be able to read the time from a mile away. Um, nice black silicone strap, black buckle. A solid case back. And then we've got water resistant, 1,000 meters, limited edition, number 408 out of 500, automatic. Flip it over. Sapphire crystal, stainless steel case. And then that cool design with the Nubio on it. Just really good looking. I've got my Magellan on the wrist today. But... Yeah, this is a very nice watch. I'm really tempted to see how this wears because um, I've slowly been transitioning out of the bigger watches. And uh, this one definitely speaks to me because it is a uh, crown at the four that makes wearing the wearing experience so much more comfortable when you don't have a big crown at the three digging into your wrist. So let's take off the Magellan and let's put this on. This is a 16 millimeter thick. This uh, Ventana. And Ventana in um, Spanish means window. It's a fun fact. I didn't look that up. That's just something I know. You guys are wondering like, why would you give that fact? Because when I hear Ventana, I automatically think window. Oop, sorry for the earthquake. And there we go, on the wrist. Let's wipe that off. Got some smudges. Strap feels good. Watch feels good. No impact from the crown. You see my mark from all the, the crowns I've, I've got dug into my wrist over the years. Definitely fits the bill. 24 millimeter lug width. And you've got no lug to lug measurement because this thing is like a perfect donut. There is no protruding lugs. The strap goes right into the case. So, uh, no lugs to contend with. So it's 50 millimeters flat. And it wears well. It actually wears pretty good. Um, this is definitely like, you know, it's called the Black Ops. And I can definitely see this being a tactical use watch. It just has that, that appeal to it. That little bit of orange on the second hand and then the thousand meters adds a nice pop to the dial. A little pop of color. And the buckle got that satin finish, matte finish with the Nubio N. They're very nice. Um, different designs, I dig them. Um, I love traditional as well. But something like this is different, but not crazy outlandish. Like the Magellan, you know, that's a whole nother level of craziness. Um a lot of busy stuff going on on this watch where this one is very clean, easy to read, nice big hands, just uh, overall really good and pleasing on the eyes, simple enough. Um, I'm not sure what the bezel insert is. It looks like it may be aluminum. It's got a matte finish on it. The case also has a matte finish. Very nice 
Very nice feeling watch. Feels quality. Looks quality. Let's get the loom. Ooh. I think this one's going to glow nice. Turn off the lights. Mm, bada bing. Yeah, that glows nice. So, another Nubio in the books. You guys let me know what you think. I'm digging it. 100% digging it. And I'm not I'm not ever going to lie to you guys and tell you I don't like a watch or I do like a watch when I don't. I'd wear this all the time. It fits right. It's comfy. It's got a really killer look. I really like the dial design. Just overall, great looking watch. If you want to check out the Nubios, I'll put a link in the description and you guys can check those out. I'll also put a link to RGMT. You guys can check out both watch brands and uh, maybe dabble and get yourself one. They're definitely dope. Anyways, stay tuned for uh, photos. Have a great day. And as always... God bless.